Hey guys, Techno Mitchell with the video for you guys. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to reduce photo size on your iPhone in a couple different ways. So let's get started now. The simple and the easiest way, first thing to do is if you are taking photos and you want them to not take up as much space, first thing you want to do is go to your setting of your iPhone. Now, in your setting of your iPhone, the main setting is going to look for the camera setting. It'll be down here. Scroll all the way here. And now you want to change the format. So you're going to click on format here. And first thing you want to select that it's high efficiency and then also along the pro default if you have a phone that has a default photo you want to click on that and verify that it is using the first setting which is heif max as you can see here that's going to take about five megabyte if you take photos now if you go with the pro raw max it's going to take 75 megabyte which is much bigger when you take photos so 5 versus 75 is a big difference so that's the first setting you want to verify now after you have verified those set settings itself now it's time to actually reduce now moving on to a second method that you can use to reduce photos that are already been captured or in your photo album let's say we have a photo and we already have a size for it how do we re reduce it what's going to be really simple there's two different ways you can do this first method is by opening up your mail app and clicking on compose here to write up a mail and you can mail yourself this again doesn't matter so let's say I want to go ahead and mail myself a photo I can press on the subject or on the body over here and I'm gonna press and hold and then go ahead and click on that arrow and one more time arrow and it says insert photo video I'm gonna click on it so I'll go ahead and click and select a photo now what happens is when I send this photo right I'm gonna go ahead and send it to myself by clicking on it I don't need a subject but you can put a subject if I send it it's gonna actually ask me if I want to reduce the size to something smaller right you can, you can see here the size difference and I can go with the actual size or something smaller or medium right whatever size I need so I'll go with something small and now it's being sent uh, with that small size now in order for me to retrieve that small size photo all I'm gonna do is go into my scent and then once I go into my scent here right I'm gonna refresh here to make sure my scent here shows up so let's go ahead and send and wait for it to show up here as you can see here it's showing up right here so I'm gonna go ahead and click on it and now I have this reduced size photo and I press and hold and I'm gonna do is save that image and if I go into my photo album as you can see here I have now a second copy now keep in mind that when you do reduce size you're gonna get the photo lose quality as well a little bit here using this method and I have a smaller size photo right now and you can play with the different sizes as well now a third method probably one of the easier way is going to be using a third party app from the app store now there's a tons of app that allows you to do that one of the ones I found is compress compress photos and pictures so if you use this one, this one, for example, is one of the ones that you can use. Again, this video is not sponsored, so you can use any of the apps that you find. There's tons of them out there. So go ahead and download it, right? I'm going to go ahead and download it right now. And once I download it, go ahead and open up, show you a quick demo of this. So as you can see, here, you want to allow access to your photos, of course, and then a selector, and then you can select the photos to come uh, to compress. So if I click on my album, let's go ahead and see. You can see here, there's the size of each of the photos listed and you can take a look at them so let's go ahead and pick maybe this one over here this isn't supported okay let's find one that is supported all right so we'll click on one hit next here and as you can see here now i can s reduce the size by reducing the quality a little bit down here maybe the dimension as well and then hit compress and of course there's ads but basically after the ads are so we should see a, a compressed photo that the app is doing for us and reducing the size of it as well so i'm going to click on close here and the compression is done so as you can see here after doing this compression we're able to save about 50 kilobyte but of course if you do more edits or reduce the size and the quality you'll be able to save a little bit more and now we can keep one original and after that we should be able to go ahead and download the photo as you can see here this is the new one with the compressed size of the photo again reducing the size as well so those are a couple ways to reduce the size of the photos on your iphone i hope this video was helpful so please make sure to like and subscribe button for more tips and tricks for your iphone and other ios devices see you guys next time